Hello everybody, I'm in my storage building. Thought I'd give you a walkthrough of, uh, I got two storage buildings. Uh, this is the one I keep all my eBay stuff in. Um, right now I have 798 listings um, that are in this building. I finally got everything eBay moved to this building. So uh, show you around a little bit. So um, I got five shelves against the back wall. Um, they're all labeled so that way I know um, where stuff is whenever uh, whenever I sell it so that way I don't have to be looking for boxes and boxes so you see I do have um, two of the shelves do have several open shelves including these these are empty boxes uh, that I just setting up here so um, all the rest of it is here um, I want to say oh yeah there are a few things that aren't um, posted so Legos that I have up here and down here, um, those aren't posted. Some of them are posted on Facebook Marketplace, um, but most, for the most part, um, they're not. And so, and then I moved um, all my empty tubs and um, a couple of tables and things in here. Um, so that's where it sits right now. Um, I'm gonna have all these cl tubs cleared out. A lot of them are broken, I need to throw away. Uh, but I need to sort them and stack them and all that kind of stuff. And those are going to stay in here. Um, I'm going to leave one of these tables um, right here by the door. So if I need to do something. And then um, back at the in the corner, um, I'm going to put two more of these, these type shelves um, in here that I have left. Uh, two or three. I think I actually have three. So, um, But I think I'm just going to leave two in here. And then I'll go show you my other building. Um, and show you what I'm going to do there. Okay, and here's my other storage building. Um, my other one is just right there, two doors down. Um, so um, I'm in the process of moving the rest of my stuff in here um, from my other storage building. So I do have one shelf, just has miscellaneous junk on it. Um, you know, here's and there's air conditioners. Um, I brought some of my tool stuff over, but a lot of that's going back over to my house. So another shelf. So I'm going to put two more shelves uh, back to back here. So that way I can get it all organized and ready to um, start posting. And then um, I have more ACs here. There's ACs underneath the, the um, table over there. So um, I buy ACs up in the winter and resell them for a high price in the summer. Um, and then just some random stuff on shelves. Uh, normally it's not this messy, but we are moving all the stuff that was in the way of these shelves. So it's just kind of all thrown cluttered over here. So, um, I do keep, um, like tubs of like, those are cheap DVDs or whatever. Um, and there's other tubs in my other building that I keep for whenever I have garage sales and stuff. Uh, just throw that out. It's kind of filler or whatever, but, um, yeah, this is my other room. Um, I do have an antique booth. And so some things need to go in there. Like I have a couple of lamps um, that should have been there a couple of months ago. I've just been kind of neglecting it. Um, so, yeah, that's my other building. Hopefully um, before Christmas is my deadline. Um, I'm going to give uh, give me that deadline to get all this stuff straightened up in the way, uh, way it needs to be. Uh, we did move like our luggage and all that kind of stuff that was in uh, our building over here. Um, and we're going to put all that stuff, we're going to organize these back tables, put all that stuff on the back wall, uh, Christmas trees and all that kind of stuff, uh, since we only use it once a year or whatever. But, um, yeah, this is my second building. Okay, everybody, I'm leaving my building now, uh, my storage unit. Um, I do want to send out, uh, not a challenge, it's something I'm going to do this next year. Uh, we're starting at the end of this year is, um, I have a second eBay account. Um, I don't really sell too much stuff one or two things a month on it mainly i think it doesn't sell because i'm new and i do have a price upwards of what i would sell it for on my my other channel uh my other account and anybody that's bought anything off of ebay knows that um, if you have a new account then people don't really trust you that much you know it's just the way it is and i understand that so like right now on that account um i have 22 feedbacks um, more than half of that is feedback from sellers, uh, stuff that I've bought, um, over this past year. 
Um, but I want to do something different with that uh, just to kind of see where I can take it. So my plan is um, to start on Christmas Day. I'm going to, uh, by then I'll have everything that's on that account taken down and done something else with. I'm going to clear out my PayPal account or the zero because that's really the only thing I use it for is for um, for that eBay account. Um, so I'm going to, I'm going to take that account to zero, um, pay off the, the, um, what I owe eBay or whatever, if, if it's even anything. Um, and then I'm going to start on, um, Christmas day and I'm going to run it from Christmas to Christmas of 2021 just to see what a brand new person can do on eBay. So my thought process was to start with $10 or less and buy stuff and flip it. And I'm just going to keep all that money in the PayPal account. And I'll do periodic updates for y'all so y'all can see um, my account, you know, how much I have left. Um, I'm going to pay the bills and stuff that, you know, the, the eBay fees and and boxes and all that kind of stuff. I'll pay it all out of that account. So that way um, we can track um, better what a new person can do on eBay part-time, starting with $0. Um, now I know this is not, um, this is not for everybody, you know, um, people, it does take time to do all these, these types of things, you know, um, and people will need, you know, people extract money out of their eBay business to pay bills and stuff like that. I understand that. I do that too. Um, but I'm, I'm just going to keep this money separate and I'm going to just let it build all year long, um, to see what that looks like. Um, I think it'll be interesting. Uh, I've done this a couple of times, um, in smaller sections. I've done, um, you know, a month at a time, start with X amount of dollars and, and go to a certain amount. Um, the, my friend on this page, uh, Michael Sanchez, this is how he got started. He, uh, me and him had a bet. We started with a hundred bucks and we saw who could, um, get to the most amount of money that month. Um, I had already been doing it for about a year, a year and a half or so at that point. And he, this was his first time doing that. And, um, I think we were somewhere around, um, maybe not. I, th I think we took that hundred dollars and turned it. I think I was like just over a thousand and he was just over 900. So I just barely beat him. So, um, in a month's time to take a hundred dollars and turn it to 900 or a thousand is a big deal, you know? Um, and that's, that's a thousand dollars cash that we had left. Um, not including the stuff that hadn't sold yet that we had already bought, you know? So, um, I thought I'd do this all year long, uh, to see if there's any interest in it. Um, just to kind of show people, uh, you know, of course at first we're, I, I'm just going to start with 10 bucks. Um, it's going to be tough. Um, I mean, it, the first month it, it's probably going to go slower, quite a bit slower. Um, I'm not going to stick just to eBay either. So, it, you know, if I find something that I can flip on Facebook marketplace, um, I'll disclose all that, you know, I'll make that part of the, the flip that I'm going to be doing, you know, so, um, I'm excited about this. Of course, I'll keep my other eBay, um, business going too. Um, I can't just cut it off and start over and start from scratch. Um, but I will have everything labeled. So I know that this is for this account and this is for the, that account, you know, um, I think it would be interesting, uh, kind of curious to where I'll end up. Um, I don't know. I was trying to guess to see, cause my other eBay will be doing stuff as well. Um, my thinking is I can probably start with $10 and make 20 or 25,000, something like that. Um, we'll see. I don't, you know, I don't know. Um, it'll be interesting to watch anyway. Um, so I'm excited about this. Um, it'll be a little bit different for me. Um, I hope I can keep up the pace all year. Uh, you know, 
things like this sound good and then life happens and you can't follow through with what you thought you were going to do and everything. So, um, I just thought I'd let y'all know and, and, um, uh, my wife is sitting here staring at me through the door wondering what I'm doing outside, but, um, yeah, anyway, um, like and subscribe, share this video. If, if you have people in your life that you think are interested in this type of deal, um, and we can go on this journey together. I think it'll be a lot of fun. So, um, thanks. Bye.